Hi, I'm Gord Miller, Environmental Commissioner of Ontario, and I'm here at Globe in Vancouver in March of 2010. And I'm here with Sid, who is uh, uh, from Australia and uh, has a, a technology called Microheat, which is a water heating technology. So can you tell me just a bit about an idea? How, how do we save energy with this? Certainly good. Um, the Microheat philosophy uh, is point of use. Mm -hmm. So we would like to get the water heated directly at the point of use. Mm -hmm. Um, a lot of other systems, whether they be electric or gas-fired, are decentralized systems, meaning that they have to distribute hot water to the point of use. From an energy and water saving perspective, if you can eliminate that distribution aspect, you'll save water and energy. We don't need to heat the pipe, the water in the pipe necessarily. We don't need to wait to the point of use for the water to get hot, thereby establishing a saving or reduction in water and energy. Yes. Uh, the other uh, conceptual issue about microheat is that because of its size, we are able to install it at the point of use. It's just this unit here? Just right? this unit here. So this is the hot water system and we advocate a side of point of use, low power and lower flow rates. Mm -hmm. We would rather distribute that capability in each point of use within the home and or commercial building uh, in order to eliminate the, point, the uh, distribution loss and thereby save energy and save water. Um, the other aspect uh, behind the design of microheat is we do not use heat exchange technology. Okay. We do not use heat exchange technology. Therefore, from an efficiency perspective, uh, we can do very low flow rates mm -hmm. very efficiently. And in a nutshell, that's what yeah, it is. That sounds great. So, and the other feature of this, of course, is you can retrofit. As most Canadian homes are, as as you say, a uh, hot water tank in the basement. But you great. can just go and retrofit this into a building and and save a considerable amount of energy and make much more efficient use of the water. In that aspect, uh, that's why we're advocating the low power. Yeah. So these are single phase units. Yeah. Meaning that they can be retrofitted into the home. Right. Um, for existing homes. Yeah. Um, being not being high power, we don't need special cabling Cab capabilities yeah. or infrastructure. No. Super. Well, thanks. So I will direct people to your website to get more information. Thanks, Sid. Thank you very much. Thanks, Good, good right. to meet you.